Group's partners with the leading radio station in KZN to bring a business breakfast to the people of Durban to update you on what's going on in society, in the economy, to get you thinking about new innovative ways of doing things. Trade and Investment was Natal has been involved with this breakfast for the past four years. to do with this is grow it every year. It's about mobilizing KZN, it's about going out, making a difference, improving on what we're doing and how we're doing it. For us we find it works because it brings the business executives of KZN and then we are able to share with them our mandates, basically in the spirit of promoting economic development in the province of Kwazulu Natal. East Coast Radio is always breaking the molds and when we choose the speakers for our business breakfast, we don't want your run-of-the-mill CEOs or marketing officers, so we had a singer. I said I wanted to talk about a degree in passion. How it happened was, the company thought what got them to where they were would get them to where they needed to get to. Lucy's a, a fantastic speaker who wins world championships, public speaking. Simply, I'm really good. You've then got Alan Not Cray, a fantastic entrepreneur with a social conscience. You have to work very hard, you have to get lucky and you have to focus. And then I spoke a little bit on thinking differently and sort of how you can put your own personal spin into these things. Creativity requires that we break patterns, that you undo something that you have always done before. The theme was Feed Your Brain and from the lineup of speakers I think everyone took away something different from each different presenter and I think it appealed not only to entrepreneurs but to business people as well. These are people that really have broken the moulds in, in their fields and I think what they've achieved and, and how they've done it uh, is testament to their success but it's, these are stories that we want to share. I thought it was awesome. The breakfast was pretty amazing, mind-blowing I must say. I did enjoy the speakers, very inspirational. I found it really fruitful. It made me one more out of life. I really am glad that I came here. I just love these events. I think what East Coast Radio are doing is more than a radio station. You know, you're, you're a brand beyond radio. We can speak to a multitude of people from a host of different backgrounds. And I think if you looked around at the audience today, it was testament of that. It was a diverse crowd, it was people across age groups, race groups, economic backgrounds, but that all were brought together with a common mindset of wanting to be better than they were yesterday. East Coast Radio. Radio.